let us solve the problem root 2 cos a is equal to cos b plus cos cube b root 2 sin a is equal to sin b minus sin cube b then find the values of sin of a minus b. So, if I want to find this, so first uh, using these equations I have to find angle a and angle b. So, if I want to find that what we do is we will consider both the equations as 1 and 2. So, let us say first equation as 1, second equation as 2. So, this is 1, this is 2. So, I will square first equation. So, 2 cos square a is equal to cos b plus cos cube b whole square which is cos square b plus cos power 6 b plus 2 cos power 4 b. Again square the second equation 2 sin square a is equal to sin b minus sin cube b whole square. So, which is sin square b plus sin power 6 b minus 2 sin power 4 b. So, after squaring I would like to add both the equations. So, adding both the equations. So, if I add them up, so 2 into cos square a plus sin square a is equal to cos square b plus sin square b plus cos power 6 b plus sin power 6 b plus 2 cos power 4 b minus 2 sin power 4 b. So, this is cos square a plus sin square a is 1. So, 2 into 1 is equal to cos square b plus sin square b again this is 1 plus this is cos power 6 b plus sin power 6 b plus 2 into cos power 4 b minus sin power 4 b. So, I want to simplify them. So, what I will do is cos power 6 b plus sin power 6 b I will take them separately. So, I will consider cos power 6 b as it is and sin square sin power 6 as sin square b whole cube because sin square theta is 1 minus cos square theta. So, cos power 6 b the 1 minus cos square b whole cube. So, I will use binomial expand I mean cube a cube minus b cube. So, 1 cube minus cos square b whole cube minus 3 cos square b plus 3 cos power 4 b. So, what I have is cos power 6 cos power 6 will get cancelled 1 minus 3 cos square b plus 3 cos power 4 b. Again we will see cos power 4 b minus sin power 4 b because that is other term which is left. So, we will write cos square b whole square minus sin square b whole square which is cos square b plus sin square b cos square b minus sin square b. So, cos square plus sin square is again 1. So, what we have is cos square b minus sin square b. So, sin square I can write as 1 minus cos square again. So, cos square b minus 1 minus cos square b. So, this is 2 cos square b minus 1. So, if I plug everything in the given equation, I mean the equation which we obtained by squaring 2 equal to 1 plus 1 minus 3 cos square b plus 3 cos power 4 b plus 2 into 2 cos square b minus 1. So, this is 2 plus 3 cos power 4 b minus 3 cos square b plus 4 cos square b minus 2. So, 2, 2, 2 will get cancelled anyway. So, what we have is 3 cos power 4 b plus cos square b. So, minus 2 equal to 0 because this 2, this 2 will get cancelled. So, this is the equation we have. So, let us say we will consider cos square b is equal to t. So, 3 t square plus t minus 2 equal to 0. So, t is equal to minus 1 plus or minus. So, 1 plus 24 by 6. So, 1 plus or minus 5 by 6. So, this is minus 1 plus 5 by 6. 
minus 1 minus 5 by 6. So, t is equal to 4 by 6 is one answer, minus 1 is other answer. What is t? t is cos square b. So, cos square b is equal to 4 by 6 minus 1. So, this value is not acceptable. So, cos b is equal to plus or minus root 2 by 3. So, I got cos b. So, if I got cos b, I can find cos a, right? Yes or no? So, that we can do. So, cos a is equal to, I mean root 2 cos a is equal to cos b into 1 plus cos square b. So, cos b is plus or minus root 2 by 3, 1 plus cos square b is 2 by 3. So, this is 5 by 3, right? So, this is plus or minus 5 root 2 by 3 root 3. So, this is cos, I mean root 2 cos a. So, cos a is plus or minus 5 by 3 root 3. So, I will get sin a also. So, sin a will be, so I have cos here. So, sin is nothing but, so if I solve this, so this is 25 and this is, I mean root 25 by 27, right. So, cos square a plus sin square a is 1. So, this is root 2 by n plus r minus root 2 by 3 root 3 will get. So, cos b we have sin b also will get. So, sin b is equal to plus or minus root 2 by 3 I mean cos square b plus sin square b is 1. So, cos square b is 2 by 3 sin square b is 1 by 3 plus or minus root 1 by 3. So, sin of a minus b. So, sin of a minus b is equal to sin a cos b minus sin b cos a. So, this is root 2 by 27 cos b is root of 2 by 3 minus sin b is root of 1 by 3. This is root of 25 by 27. So, we have root 81 in denominator. So, root 81. So, this is root 4 minus root 25. So, which is 2 minus 5 by 3, I mean 9. So, which is minus 1 by 3. So, other value is minus of all these values. So, sin of a minus b other value is. So, instead of plus, we will substitute minus now. Minus of root 2 by 27 minus root 2 by 3 and minus root 1 by 3 minus root 25 by 27. So, which will give us minus root 4 plus root 25 by root 81, which is minus 2 plus 5 by 9. So, which is 1 by 3. So, the possible values of sin a minus b are minus 1 by 3 and plus 1 by 3.